All right, so it looks like we got a little work in project Civic here. It's pretty nice. Needs a front end though, but uh, you know, you wouldn't call it a work in project if it didn't have a front end, right? <laughs> Very cool. Keep working, buddy. Keep working. All right, so I stopped by the Hobby Lobby over here in Manhattan, and uh, it looks like I've come just in time. They're putting some stuff out. Uh, they still haven't put everything out and obviously none of this has made it to the shelf yet. It just got put here on the uh, front row there. So all of this is probably everything from last week. And if I just move the cards to the side, oh, that guy's still there. Man, that's money. Uh, oh yeah, him too. So yeah, all this is just the same stuff as last week. Lots of low riders. So what's new? We got a Ford Mustang Coupe. It's nice. We've got the Hooker Headers Lift Kit with the Chevy Nova. That is kind of nice. I like that. 5,000 pieces worldwide. That's a good one. That's a good one. We got another lift kit here. Got some uh, Ford Torinos. Very nice. Actually, this one does say there are 750 chase pieces i don't think this is one of them so that's fine looks good though looks real good got another military truck so we can just put them in somewhat the appropriate place and there that'll help out a little bit and uh maybe we'll come back and see if anything else gets loaded onto these shelves, but right now that was it. So, uh, any new models? This is a good model, but not a good price. All right, oh, 40% off, cool. I think we're good. Let's uh, go try another shop. All right, moving on. All right, so I'm over here at Target and it looks like the supply is dwindling down, down, down. But I did see something on the shelf that some of you guys might be pretty interested in. So I'm gonna look at it. Ooh, look at that, that's new. I didn't see that. Thomas the Train, look at that, that's new. There's the bug. Oh, that's not what I was talking about. That's cool though, I might have to get that. Let's see, let's go back to what I was talking about dead over here so let's take a walk all right <laughs> you guys might like this it might be the giveaway for this month along so first place might be the fao schwartz gold hot wheels we're gonna grab that up today you know why we're gonna grab that up today because it's on clearance <laughs> oh man so we're gonna grab that up today this is awesome and we're still going to do the, uh, anything else on clearance? No, no, no. We're still going to do the, uh, GameStop exclusive as well. So this will probably go to the, uh, first place giveaway winner. And then maybe I'll do a GameStop exclusive as well. And then the second place winner will get maybe both GameStop exclusives. The, uh, what was it, the 1970s Camaro and the green GT. So we'll probably do something like that. But uh, yeah, we're definitely walking away a winner here. And by the end of the month, one of you can be a winner as well. Very cool, very cool. Can't believe that was just sitting on the shelves. I bet it was a return. I bet somebody bought a crap load of these things and couldn't sell them all and was like, all right, I'm gonna take it back and get my money back. But that works out for me because now it's on clearance and I get it. And now one of you are going to get it too. Sweet. Very cool. All right. Moving on to the next spot. There you go. Clearance price, $8.50. Nice. Total savings, $11.49. Awesome. Thank you, Target. <laughs> okay. So I'm at a Dollar Tree in Topeka and it looks like I finally have my first sighting of B case. So this is kind of exciting. 
So we got here the uh, Roger Dodger camouflage. So that's pretty cool. So we're gonna pick one of those up today for sure. We got the new poison arrow. So definitely gonna pick up one of those as well. Uh, here's another Roger Dodger. We'll leave, leave some of them, can't take them all. Here's the Tony Hawk skateboard. So my son was just talking about that. So we'll bring that home for him. This is cool. I'm pretty glad we get to see our first sighting. So here is what would have been the Super. So here we have the 300 SL. So that's here still. But this looks like a couple of cases. So there could have been something great here and we missed it, but it's all right. Uh, this car is all I actually care about. <laughs> awesome, because I, uh, I want to complete that Legends Tour so we're definitely going to bring this one home. We'll put that with my stack here. It's nice, very nice to see a fresh case. It's been a while. So here we have the B case. Very good. Lots of Batmobiles. And yeah, I'll check them over. Just make sure that uh, some people have been saying they've been finding a Batmobile Super in the B case as well. So we'll give that a once over. Uh, yeah, let's go through the rest of the case here. Uh, Oh yeah, look at that, Sylvia, beautiful. Very nice, very nice. You got another, uh, what is that, the uh, Dragon Wagon. I'm telling you, that's one of my faves. Somebody put in the comments, why? <laughs> why do I love it? Because I just do. Uh, I don't need a rhyme or reason. I just love it because I love it. Is this teed off? Teed off too. Very cool. So we never did get to go to the uh, the golf course. What is that? The Caddyshack golf course to get it signed. Maybe we'll take it. Hopefully, it's only like two and a half hours away. I say only like that's a short trip. <laughs> All right, let me finish going through here and uh, I'll do a wrap up. All right, so I found a couple more. So I did find the SVO Mustang. That recolor is sweet. I did hear that there's gonna be a Zamic of this. Don't quote me on that. I'm just saying that's what I heard. So that would be pretty cool to see as well. Uh, definitely getting that today. I found the recolor of the Nissan Maxima Drift car. That's kind of nice. I like it, I like it. Let's see, there's the Bentley. I like it, but I don't think I'm getting it today. I didn't realize that this was part of the B case. So I saw this car already and I thought it was part of the A case when I saw it at like O'Reilly's or AutoZone or wherever I saw it. So they had already gotten B case at the auto parts store. So wow, I'm actually really surprised by that. So that was actually a B case car. The Camaro, that's pretty cool. I'm not getting that today though. Uh, El Camino, very cool. Very cool actually. Uh, might get that today. Teed off, yeah, I'm getting teed off, why not? Yes, 100%. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll get it for my son, he wants that. Yes, I gotta get a plane. And yeah, I'm definitely gonna get the Roger Dodger with the new paint scheme, that's pretty cool. All right, so we're getting a bunch of cars today. So yeah, first sighting of a uh, B case. I found another one, where did I hang you? So there was at least two, and by the looks of this, I would even say like three or four cases. So there's a lot of cases here. I'm gonna go with four, and I did find another one. Where did I put you? Uh, did I stick you in this box? I think I found it in this box and then I hung it back up on the shelf, but I don't remember where. No, I guess it's not that important because it's not the super, <laughs> right? Not the super, so it doesn't really matter. Anyway, uh, yeah, I think we're good. We're moving on to the next spot. Cool, cool. Oh, there it is, found it. I hung it on the matchbox. So found at least two but I'm pretty sure there was more than two. I think there was probably uh, about four cases here. This looks like four cases worth because there was a metric ton of these Batmobiles in there. So, but yeah, yeah, just two of these. So hopefully someone got lucky. They got themselves a super, congratulations to them. Uh, I got 
at least this car, the Volvo Gasser, because it's the Legends Tour winner, and I love the Legends Tour cars. So very cool. All right, we're moving on.